I'm worried about your gran. You don't go out anymore. Nonsense. I'm not talking about shopping at Freshgo's or Dev's. I'm talking about seeing your friends. Friends? <laughs> Is Jeff telling you who you can and can't see? No. All right, well, uh, when was the last time you went to the Rovers? You know I'm trying to stay away from alcohol. That doesn't mean that you should stay away from people, too. I'm not the only one who's worried about you. I hear stories that he locks you up. What? In a box. He was practising a magic trick. He left you locked up for how long, exactly? There was a problem with one of the catches, entirely my fault. Tea? Jeff cares for me. He helps me. Helps you with what? So many things. My, my problem with alcohol, for one. You don't have a problem with alcohol. Thanks to Jeff. He helps you with your money, too, does he? All those finances, those numbers that you knew inside out are now suddenly too difficult for you, are they? He's taking money out of speed dial. Why is he taking money out? <laughs> you didn't know about it, did you? I'm sure there's a perfectly innocent explanation for it. Just like there was an explanation when he locked you in a box and went out. But you can say that the catch was broken and I won't believe you. Say that he didn't mean to leave you in there and I won't believe you. But you can say that he doesn't mean you any harm and I will not believe you. He loves me! He tells me every day. Do you know how many times your grandfather told me that he loved me? None! I'd like you to go now. Please, he'll be back any minute. You're scared of him? Of course not. Has he hit you? Alia! Has he physically hurt you? How can you think such a thing when he loves me? He's controlling you. You don't know him. Now, please, before he gets back. OK. OK, I'll go, but only so I don't cause you any trouble. Please! You know where I am, all right? Day or night. Hello, darling. I'm making your favourite for tea. Nihari. Shepherd's pie is my favourite. Still. Hey, you didn't go to that rip-off butcher's down the road, did you? No, and I got just what I needed. Receipt. You have done well. Very well. <laughs> I was... I was wondering, perhaps, if you'd like to, when we've eaten, we could go out. Where to? Oh, I don't know. Rovers. Oh, I see. All this favourite tea routine is buttering me up so you can go to the pub. No. That desperate for a drink, are you? Not at all, no. It's just with my back being better now, and you said earlier about going for a pint. I thought it'd be nice. No, 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 no. no. Oh, you don't want to go to Cyprus with me. I don't want to go to the Rovers with you. I'll put the kettle on. Do you want one? I don't take all night to think about it. Oh, oh yes, I, I'm sorry. Yes, I, yes. You're the luckiest woman in the world, Abermere's husband, aren't you? <laughs>